Hey guys, what's up? I Sack the Tron here from One Hive Gazette, here with my next video. And uh, in this one, I'm showing you guys how people are getting the three star at Town Hall 9 and Town Hall 10 after the update uh, in three minutes now. You might, you're gonna see probably, well, not the new troop or anything, but uh, the Valks at work, some new stuff, uh, kind of how attacks will probably look a little bit more uh, post update, or at least until people start using hogs or Valks maybe at Town Hall 10. Uh, we'll see about that. Um, kind of like a war recap video, I guess. I already showed you guys quite a few attacks in my last video um, of the update video, but have some more that were also post-update attacks. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of them, starting with Thor, kind of showing us how Town Hall 10s can still get the 3-star, and not even using the, the new and improved Hog Rider or Valk. Um, he's just doing the old-fashioned... Uh, that's been working for a while, Queen Walk, La Loon Attack, and works out very nicely here. Um, the update was supposed to apparently like nerf Queen Walks, and I think it did to some extent because it essentially made it so you can do a shorter Queen Walk just because it takes up so much time, because um, time is a big resource, and uh, Queen Walks require a lot of it. But anyway, uh, Thor is still doing a Queen Walk, um, has to move a little bit quicker, has to start the second part of his attack a little bit sooner, um, and this base isn't maxed out, and it's not an anti-3-star layout, but it still has level 3 Inferno, a so solid Town Hall 10, uh, that's still relatively hard to 3-star at Town Hall 10. Um, and Thor does a nice job here. So anyway, as the Queen walks going, goes ahead and sends the King in. Few wall breakers, um, just going to let the King enter into the base. Few wizards to back him up, let him start moving forward. Just get in there, get that first air defense taken out. Also, it's going to pull pull the CC, but the CC troops aren't going to be a big deal. Um, the king will go down, but now they're away from the queen, so she's going to be a little bit have a little more time before she has to engage the hound, which is great. Show off time to get to that second air defense, I believe. Uh, right here, she'll step up and take a shot at it. Goes ahead and drops the quake, uh, which I guess he didn't need, so drops on the town hall and the inferno tower. Anyway, here comes the air attack. Goes ahead and sends in all three Lava Hounds at the beginning. Uh, make sure he has a lot of tankage. And the, that's really the only air defense that's left up. So might as well. Uh, here come the balloons. Just kind of storming the space with balloons. All different directions. Had a relatively small kill squad investment. So has a lot of balloons and a lot of Lava Hounds. Just swarming the rest of the space, like I said. Coming in, still has a freeze spell for the Inferno, uh, which will drop in just a moment. Also get a few of those Teslas. Uh, so good value for the freeze when he drops it there. And uh, everything's, for the most part, locked onto those Lava Hounds. The Queen is still up doing work. Um, has one balloon, which he hasn't even deployed yet. You can see the balloons just making their way through, um, taking out these Teslas, which do do quite a, dam quite a bit of damage to balloons, but has so many of them, plus the Lava Hounds. Uh, this base is going down pretty quickly. Um, right here, the last few defenses going down. And the queen is still up. She'll take out the enemy king as she goes. And uh, go ahead and get the 3-star. So awesome attack to Thor. Uh, Town Hall 10s are still getting the 3-star, even post-update. And hopefully we'll see a little bit of ground action for 3-stars once people get the max level hogs and valks. But anyway, uh, let's go ahead and go down to some Town Hall 9s. I kind of already showed the top Town Hall 10 replays. And a lot of them got wiped clean from the update because they came before the update. Uh, but there was a few post-update replays that haven't yet been shown. And these might characterize uh, some of the Town Hall 9 attacks you'll see a little bit more. This one uh, coming in with uh, some golems and just a goho, I guess. No queen walk. And I don't think queen walk is going to be used quite as much at Town Hall 9. I think dragons got a nerf because they take up time. Usually you need a queen walk to go with them. Uh, so they're going to be too time consuming for the most part um, on most bases I think uh, but Jay's clone goes ahead and still lures out the CC just puts the lava hound over in the corner which works out nicely then comes in here with the kill squad which I think you'll see a lot more just both heroes in one kill squad a little less uh, exotic as far as queen walks and various things you do with the heroes and all that good stuff all the kill squad accessories and all that I think you'll see more just direct uh, stoned, uh, cold-blooded, whatever you want to call it, gohos, coming in with some golems, uh, getting some double giant bomb sets if you can, and getting the queen, obviously, and the CC troops. But anyway, comes in here with the kill squad. They're still tanking for everything, which is nice. Here come the hogs. First heal for them, keeping them up. Uh, this is obviously a good base to do it on because it's so compact. You can just send in a big group of hogs, put a heal down, let them just work their way through. Um, there is that last double giant bomb spot between the... Uh, um, 
expo and the wizard tower but as you can see here the hogs are going to kind of path around it and uh, works out pretty well here still has one heal spell left and a few hogs which he hasn't even deployed yet he'll drop that last heal in just a moment as long uh, along with the rest of the hogs that come through and you can see they're kind of negated that double giant bomb spot one bomb does go off and does kind of get the side of a few of his hogs but no big deal still has plenty left up plus the queen uh, the lava hound busted but most of the pups are going down anyway i'll fast forward as cleanup happens awesome three star uh, like i said you'll see more of these uh no queen walk just straight up kill squad hogs uh action at town hall nine i'm thinking but we'll have to see how it shapes up all right for the last attack i'm going to show we do have some valks which I think are going to be pretty powerful at Town Hall 9, now that they do more damage. I think their hit points did go down a little bit, but um, they still have more hit points than a giant, and that's quite a bit. So, boss coming in here with 7 Valks um, and a few Golems. Just dropping down the Golems, creating the funnel, all normal stuff. Um, quite a few Wizards, but I'm always a big fan of bringing a lot of Wizards, especially if you can keep them alive behind your Golems. Because I think the 4 troop space is worth it for the amount of damage they can do potentially if you use them right. I like the uh, set of wall breakers that comes in here and gets another wall taken out. Instead of having to drop like 2 jump spells, can only has to use 1 jump spell and can bring an extra heal for his troops. So it worked out nicely there. Good wall breaker placement. Uh, double poison the Lava Hound. Also some of the heroes getting that poison. Here come the Valks and you can see they're going to swing faster um, and quicker. So as soon as they go, go up to a building... Boom, they swing right there. Swing's already started. They're doing a little bit more damage. It might be hard to notice. Um, they are going down a little bit quicker without a heal spell, uh, but they pretty much cleared out the entire core of that base, and the hogs are going to come around and basically clean out, clean out the ring of the base. So, worked out great here. Awesome attack. Hogs making their way through. Still has a heal spell left. Probably could have dropped a few hogs over on those defenses on the right side because they were taking for the cannon for quite a few seconds that a, a hog scooter came in and got the cannon while it was distracted but no big deal um hogs are still making their way through i'll go ahead and uh, go times two in just a moment because cleanup's going to start the hogs have already taken out everything except that cannon in the wizard tower which they're going to right now uh cannon's back on a golemite which is great queen just popped the ability she's making her way around same with the king just used the ability there i think valks are going to be very powerful at town hall nine and uh, you can see people doing a pretty good job, even in the three-minute uh, time constraints. No problem for Town Hall 9, in my opinion. I think it's still going to be somewhat easy for a, a high-level war clan to get all the 9s uh, cleared. And then uh, for Town Hall 10s, I'm, I'm interested to see how it's going to work out. I think it's going to be harder than it was before the update, but it also could be made easier by the new troop levels. We'll have to see how those two factors, you know, of the time versus well time and some defensive buffs versus the new troop levels plus the bowlers if they are any kind of factor in the cc anyway though hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, more gameplay coming out as always so i'll see you guys in my next video until then bisect a trend out